Greetings everyone, welcome to Blend Graph. Today, I will be demonstrating how to create photorealistic artwork using Blender 3D. For this tutorial, I have downloaded a cup model from Blender Kit. You can easily find this model by searching for T in the search bar. Unfortunately, I could not find a good biscuit packet model, so I created a basic one myself, even though I am not skilled in modeling. Moving on, I applied an image texture downloaded from Google to the biscuit packet model. You can use any biscuit packet image of your choice. Next, let's focus on the environment. Add a plane and adjust its size to resemble a table. Then, add a table texture and edit it in the UV editing tab. For the window, add another plane, subdivide it a few times, and cut some faces from the center to create the window frame. Apply a concrete texture to it. To create the appearance of a room, add a cube. Since this part will not be visible in the camera view, you don't need to add any material to it. Finally, add some trees in the background to create a dynamic look. Now let's move on to the lighting part. Add an HDRI and set its strength to 0.7. Then, add a sun and adjust its strength to 3. Lastly, add the camera and adjust the angle to your preference. Add depth to the camera and there it is. Your first image is ready. Now, let's move on to the second image. Everything is the same as the first image, but I added a teapot that I downloaded from the Blender kit. Let's start by discussing the environment. I wanted this image to be different from the previous one, so I decided to change the location to an outdoor into nature. Therefore, I hit the window and room, and kept everything else the same. Then, I added the teapot to the composition. Now, let's talk about the fluid simulation. I will go into more detail about this topic in another video. For now, simply copy these settings. There you have it. This is how you can create a photorealistic render using Blender 3D.